still wanted a whiskey, my hungry needed beans. It had been a month of three days since I had heard that eagle scream. So with a stomach full of empty and a pocket full of dreams, I left my pride and stepped inside a bar. <laughs> Actually, I guess you'd call it a tavern. Cigarette smoke to the ceiling and sawdust on the floor. Friendly shadow. I saw that there was just one old man sitting at the bar. In the mirror, I could see him checking me in my guitar. He turned and said, come up here, boy, show us what you are. I said, I'm dry, you bought me a beer. He nodded at my guitar and said, it's a tough life, ain't it? I just looked at him. He said, you ain't making any money, are you? I said, you've been reading my mail. He just smiled and said, let me see that guitar. I got something you ought to hear. Then he laid it on me. If you waste your time on talking to people who don't listen to the things that you are saying, who do you think you're gonna hear? And if you should die explaining how things that they complain about are things that could be changed. 